You also have the option to display ADSB traffic when connected to Sentry. This is enabled by turning on the Traffic layer on the Maps tab. Individual targets will be displayed, including relative altitude in hundreds of feet, climb or descent trend, track, and N number if available. Moving targets are shown with an arrowhead pointing in the direction the aircraft is moving, while stationary targets are shown with a diamond. Airborne targets are blue, and ground traffic is brown. If you're in flight and come in close proximity to another aircraft, ForeFlight will display an alert. The app uses all available data to make predictions based on both horizontal and vertical closure rate. So while an airplane may be three miles away, if it's converging quickly, ForeFlight will display an alert to give you time to start looking and change course if necessary. Traffic, 10 o'clock, 4 miles, 1,000 feet below. The app uses two alert levels to highlight approaching traffic targets. Yellow targets are within two nautical miles and 1,200 feet, or will be within 45 seconds. These don't represent an imminent collision, but are intended to get your attention to start visually scanning for the traffic. Red targets are within 1.2 nautical miles and 1,200 feet, or will be within 25 seconds. These demand your immediate attention and are accompanied by a visual and audio traffic alert. ADSB traffic will also be displayed in the synthetic vision view. Sometimes, especially when flying near busy airports, the map screen can become cluttered with all the nearby aircraft. To alleviate this problem, tap on the gear button and then turn on the Hide Distant Traffic feature. This will only show traffic within 15 miles and plus or minus 3,500 feet of your aircraft. If you're on the ground and connected to Wi-Fi or cellular data, ForeFlight will display Internet-based traffic on the map from a FlightAware feed when the traffic layer is enabled. This can be a great pre-flight planning tool to give you a feel to gauge the activity level for your planned airports and surrounding airspace. 